Hello, ladies. This is Miss Alicia coming to you in an update video. Now, I know that I have been gone for a long time, and I am so, so sorry. Um, to make a long story short, I was recording everything from my phone, but I needed a digital camera for better quality. But then I found a new phone that was coming out because I need a new phone too, with pretty much a digital camera built into it. So I had to wait until that came out, which it came out on June the 4th, the HTC Evo 4G with Sprint, which is an amazing phone, best phone ever, hands down. And um. Now that I got it, as you can see, the picture quality is better. So I did it for y'all. I did it for y'all. You're welcome. You're welcome. Okay. But, um, anyways, oh, thank you to all my subscribers. I love you all so much. And I was so surprised to see you subscribing because I'm like, you know, what they, like, what? What they subscribing for? I'm not doing nothing but what I always do. I'm just doing it in front of a camera and explaining my thoughts. Like, oh, this hair is not good. I'm just saying it on camera. That's pretty much it. But, anyways, thank you all for subscribing and watching and being patient with me. I really, really appreciate it. Now, this hair. Okay, um, this is the same hair that I had installed on my last video, the Bobby Boss Indie Remy Ocean Wave. Another thing, Bobby Boss Indie Remy is not Virgin Indian Remy hair. It's not, I'm sorry, it's not, I'm saying that so you won't go and think you're purchasing one thing and you're not and it doesn't turn out the way that you want, it's because it's not what you think it is. And um, I found that out by just researching it and I believe Indy Remy, I know the phrase Indy Remy comes from the way that they process it. I believe it's because they process it to imitate Indian hair, I believe that's the correct definition but I know it comes from the way that they process or whatever. Um I'm not being paid by them, trust me, from what I'm finna say, they wouldn't be paying me for it. But uh yeah. But if they want to, hey, send me some money. I'm spend I'm giving you some. I said give me some too. But um anyways, um I'm wearing the Ocean Wave fourteen inch at the bottom, twelve inch at the top. Um I just washed it last night because of some one or two videos that I saw on YouTube that were pretty much horror videos that if I didn't know anything about it and was looking to purchase after watching those videos I would not purchase ever so I was like okay I'm gonna do a video but I'm gonna do it after I shampoo my hair so people can see you know a lot of things go into a horrible hair experience it could be the products you use on it, it could be the way you shampoo it, it could be um, the hair itself, it could be a lot of things, don't just think, oh, the hair must not be good, It could. Uh, it's a lot of factors that can go into a horrible hair experience, so take that into consideration. Um, I use my Cantu Shea Butter, what's this, shampoo, and my <laughs> conditioner, sorry. And um, there. This is a very, very good, good quality. Smells great. Makes your hair feel great, and it's inexpensive. It's like four bucks at Walmart. So yeah, check it out. I think it's like five in the beauty supply. So yeah. Um, what I did was I shampooed it. I think I'm gonna do a video explaining my shampoo and process. But anyways, I shampooed and conditioned it, towel dried it. I put some of this in my Bow Silk Silk Therapy which I haven't used in the entire install, but for some strange reason decided to. Put a dime size of this, a dime size into my hand, rubbed it, ran out through my hair, wiped the rest of it on my towel. You know if I wipe some on my towel and I only use the dime size, you know much didn't go into my hair. Um, scrunched it and diffused it. And when I combed it out, this is what it looked like. And this is a four week, I'm sorry, a one week shot of my two month mark. And as you can see, it still has a lot of body, a lot of movement to it, and I still love it. Now, um, I haven't curled it or styled. This is what it looks like after being shampooed. I haven't curled it, or you know, if I did, I would have did something to this front instead of having it like, yeah. But I, this is after being shampooed. This is what it looks like. Um, 
Now, um, like I said, 14 at the bottom, 12 at the top, if I did say that. Um, tangling, not an issue. And what I mean by not an issue, ladies, all hair, all hair, whether it's your natural hair or whether it's your weave, it's going to shed, it's going to tangle, like seriously, seriously. But anyways, um, tangling is not an issue. What I mean by that is, because apparently it needs an explanation, um, it's nothing that a quick run through of your fingers can't solve, quite frankly. That's pretty much it. The only time I really grab a comb or brush is to do my leave out. And that's pretty much it. Now, um, shedding, however, is a small issue. It's not a, a big issue, but it is a small issue. I can't say it's not an issue with it. Um, the hair, just like the straight hair, comes out in strands of, in groups of between two and four. The only difference with this hair, it does it more often. It does shed, and sometimes, honestly, it can get annoying. Like, seriously, it, it can get annoying, and it has been a little at times for me, because sometimes I don't get any strands, and sometimes I get about three, four strands, and then maybe an hour later get three, four more strands, and you know, I'll get handfuls, but sometimes it can just be annoying. It's not a, a major issue. It's not a deal breaker. But I did try to sell my West. If you're wondering why didn't you sell your West like you did with straight hair. I tried, but I did it in a rush. So I didn't do it properly. I didn't make sure that the selling got all the way through. So maybe if I would have did it properly, it would have done better. But anyways, um, I am extremely, extremely disappointed that it did not revert back to its original curl. Like, I'm extremely disappointed because the Saga Parisian Glam, which had the pretty much same wave pattern as this, if you watch the video, I hold the hair that was left over that I never used up to the sew end I had in for, I think, a month and a half, maybe two, and the wave pattern was identical. With this, it's not like that. Like this right here. This is what the hair looked like at first. This right here. Well, no. This right here. But a little deeper. But it's, it's this up here that bothers me. Like, I don't I don't like that. I don't like the fact that... Now, it's not ugly. It's still pretty, I guess. So many compliments on it. But it's more of a beach wave now versus a curly. You know, and I, I really... I'm disappointed. I'm not going to say I don't like it, but I am extremely disappointed that if Sucker can do it, A, and the Remy needs to be able to do it better. You know what I'm saying? It's like, I'm really, really disappointed in that. You know, some people it may not be a big deal because hey, it's still pretty. But for me, I am really upset about this. Now, um, after this video, best believe I will be putting heat in this hair and curling it. Now I'll do a video about that later on. But the hair does hold a curl very well. When I curl my hair, typically, I don't curl it for the rest of the week because it holds a curl so well. And I do love that about this hair. And um, that is pretty much it. I don't use anything on it but this right here if I haven't showed you already. And this is my Dove Daily Moisture Therapy. It's starting to run low. It sounds like it's about this much left and I got it in January. So if it's that much left, you know I don't use it often. I use it maybe once or twice a week, every blue month. Great product, and it's inexpensive. It's like three, maybe four dollars. It's really, really good. I suggest you go and get this. And that is pretty much it. That's pretty much it. If I left anything out, or if you want me to make a video doing either my shampoo or the curling process or whatever, or me tightening because I tighten up after I sew my hair in. Well, before I uh, before I shampoo my hair, I tie my sew in. If you want me to do a video of how or explaining how I tie my sew in, leave a comment about that. I try to make it my mission to reply to every comment posted within 24 or 48 hours. Every comment. But that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for my subscribers. Um, if you have any questions, suggestions, anything like that, please comment and I'll be sure to reply to them. And you'll be seeing me more often since I got my new camera. All right.